Hi everyone, today I am going to discuss about first PUC physics annual practical exam pattern. As we know that for physics subject there is a total 100 mark is there. In that 100 mark 70 mark is for theory part and 30 mark is for practical section. About theory section, blueprint and question paper analysis as I already discussed in a previous video, you please go through that. Today I am purely going to discuss about the practical part. In the practical section, there is total 30 mark is there for practical part. That 30 mark is divided into several criteria. Now I will go through that. Here for facing the practical exam the time duration is 2 hours within 2 hours we have to complete the allotted experiment by doing that with a good result and unit okay here total 30 mark is there that 30 mark is again divided into some parts okay here 20 mark is for performing the experiment and for viva questions 4 mark is there and practical record book 6 mark is there totally 30 here first i will discuss about the performing the experiment in annual practical exam you have to pick the one sheet in that which experiment name is there that experiment we have to perform in that particular mentioned time the maximum allotted time is 2 hours within 2 hours you have to do the experiment calculation and result with a unit here first i will discuss about the performing the experiment the total mark is 20 in that 20 mark how the marks are going to distribute that I will discuss now. First of all, if any experiment came, you have to write the principle of that experiment. For writing the principle, the allotted mark is 2 mark. Means on which principle the experiment works or performs that we have to write there on which principle law hmm, that we have to write next for that two mark is there and second step writing the formula and explaining the terms we have to write the relevant formula and we have to abbreviate or we have to write the terms the terms what are going to explain in that experiment for that two mark is there and third one writing the diagram figure circuit with labeling okay writing the diagram relevant formula relevant figure diagram and labeling that is carrying the two mark and fourth one writing the tableau column observation pattern for that also two mark is there when you enter the physics laboratory after choosing the slip or token we have to sit to the, the mentioned table and we have to perform the that experiment in that first these four steps you have to write after that you have to show to your mentioned in charge and took a sign from them after their signature we have to operate the apparatus or instrument in first puc there is the only handling of instrument is there in second puc physics we have the circuits that we have to connect in a correct manner and get observed by that in charge examiner okay here in first view you see no need to connect any wires or circuit only you have to handle the apparatus 
in that after writing the four steps we have to write the preliminary observation means if you handling any instrument that having the least count you have to obtain the or you have to write the the mentioned values least count how the least count is calculated and after that constructing the experimental setup bar circuit in first few you see you are having only the handling the apparatus okay there is no need to connection but in second pvc the electric circuit connection is there in that you have to connect several apparatus like ammeter battery voltmeter rheostat plug key galvanometer these are the mainly used experiments or these apparatus are going to use in the, the doing the experiment okay next after connection the circuit or constructing the circuit uh, you have to perform the experiment in a right way that has to be considered okay that is performing the experiment and entering the readings into the tabular column observation or patterns you have to connect the circuit or you have to operate the apparatus in the correct way and we have to tabulate the readings which you got during that experiment okay during the performing the experiment and for that you have four mark okay then after entering the readings to the tableau column we have to do the calculation by using the that mentioned formula okay after calculation if a graph is there you have to plot the graph okay you have to mention the scale you have to calculate the slope okay after that you have to use that slope into the calculation for that process three mark is there and after that final step is result with unit you have to write the result in a correct way and you have to mention the that physical quantity it is uh, is uh, it is a length or mass or temperature or time whatever the physical quantity is there that you have to mention in that for doing these several steps uh, the different marks allotment is there you have to perform in the systematically if any candidate or student fails to perform these steps mentioned steps he will or she will going to lose that respective marks suppose if a student fails to write the principle of the experiment he will lose two mark if a student fails to write the formula of that mentioned experiment he will lose two mark in the same way if any one or any student fails to perform the step he will lose the respective allotted marks after adding these all steps the total allotted mark is 20 mark okay this completes the during the experiment or performing the experiment after that the another 10 mark is there and there are four mark in that 10 mark four is for viva questions the in charge faculty is going to or going to ask oral questions means he or she may ask to you people that definitions formula dimension formula physical quantity si units either it is scalar or vector huh? like that the faculty will going to ask the oral questions about that mentioned experiment okay for that four mark is there after that another six mark is there that is for record book practical record or you may call it as a journal in that we have to perform the or you have to write the 10 to 12 experiments and you have to get get it signed by your in charge staff and hod as well as principal ok 
okay after taking the principal sign or hod sign that journal is considered as the certified journal or record book for that you have to get 6 marks like that for a practical section totally 30 mark is there okay if you follow these all steps in systematically easily you are going to get the allotted marks okay thank you